Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Uh, we're doing a guild battle and we're fighting against Tyrants. And Tyrants is uh, actually a really good guild. So I need to make sure that I can win every match that I fight. So I have to make sure that happens. This ma the first matchup I could win with this setup. That's for sure. But the second matchup... I'm not so sure about that. Oh. How should I do the second matchup? He's not really having immense DPS. Only DPS is him. Um, the Archangel needs to die. Um, how should we do this? What is a good option I actually was thinking of going like this but he will attack that guy he will attack Baladion and Chloe could either attack Baladion or Mara but it should not be that high amount of damage that I couldn't win and I could go for that unit right off the bat. I think it's not like a bad idea. Because I, I should be, they're all support, so I should be able to get that done. Or, another option is going with these two. Um, hmm. <clears throat> that won't work because he will remove the buffs, debuffs constantly. First round, I'm pretty sure I can win. Second round, I, to be honest, I think it's gonna be fine because the the only damage that's coming in for Mara is uh, Chloe, and I have two healers, so it should be okay. Obviously, I'm saying that now, but it, you cannot know that until the end. I don't know what's to kill. Okay. <laughs> Actually, I'm gonna not attack him because I need some damage on my. Rama goes before I can clean shot. Nice. We're immune again. I think I could go just soon rather fast. Like right about now. I'm gonna try it. Yes. Good job. Uh, let's heal up because the only damage is coming from these two guys on my Remigo, so... And we need to wait some turns. They should do enough damage. So the first fight was relatively easy. The second fight I'm not so sure, because... There's always a danger that... Uh, for some reason the AOE of the Thermos will get a lot of damage on my Mara and the Mara goes low and then they decide to attack that. We'll see. Also the speed might be a, a thing because I want I need a defense break to kill a unit. I think I'll focus on Thermos first because he seems to be the most uh, Dangerous for me if to face and if I can kill him with the soul crusher, I can just Not let him revive so that's a good thing now Let's heal again clean shot is not up yet And he will do an next start So that's the first match one the second one. I think I, I should win. I think I should win the last two guild battles or three guild battles have been a bit, uh, how do you say that, a bit too quick with my fights. I just 
did my fights, didn't really think things through, went with setups that weren't like the best, uh, and that cost me a few matches. The reason why I did that is trying things out, because most of the time we already won the match, like we already won the guild battle. Not like when I started right off the bat, but a lot of the time it was pretty clear that we were going to win. But this match is not clear at all if we win. I think we will win, but we have to do our best. Okay, this is an interesting round. This is what I mean. You see? That could cause a problem. I'm going to heal up right now. That there could be a problem. Did this spell? I'll do a stun. Let's see how much damage we can put in it. No, nothing special, sadly. Defense break, get a turn. Let Mara go, please. Crit, crit. Bam! Gotcha! Okay, next up, that little. Little girl. That was epic. Yeah, why not? Ooh, nice. Now he, oh, he will heal. That's super nice. I'm not going to kill Chloe just yet. Thank you. That's exactly what I wanted to happen. Now he's dead. He will revive. And if I'm correct, he has no heal. Damn it. Defense break. I'll defense break both. Correct. Bam! Gotcha. So this was actually a good plan. I got uh, all stun, but he didn't have violent or anything, so it was okay. Plus he would have gone on my Baladon. Nice. Took you out. That was a good match. Uh, let's see. We got a full member here, so I wonder what he's running. Um, let's see if we can think about a setup that will do good against him. Hmm. I got a feeling that this unit is a crit, is damn respect for crit. <clears throat> so is A man. So taking in a case is not the worst idea ever. Hmm. He should not be super fast. Jameer is a possibility together with cases is not bad. Together with something. Heal debuff. More damage. What do I want there? Like an Amon, but Amon is too weak. Don't like to play with that unit right now. Hmm. Lucian could be great. I could also run something like this. Because then I will not have too much problem with defense. Well, I will have problems, but not as much. Huh. Because everyone has high resist. And I can dispel it. And then the second one is... Well, no, it's not easy, but it's going to be the the dream team. <laughs> no, my, my team that will probably win it. Eventually, um, let me just check my own uh, cases out because I'm not 100% sure if she's up for that task that I'm putting her up for. 
plus 16 geysers, health pool is decent, speed is okay, despair, speed, why do I have these runes on plus 6, really I should upgrade them, but fuck, I'm not gonna waste my mana right now, I think she's up for the task, where's the unit, there, thinks he's up for that task. I have to think this through one more time. How this is gonna go. Um, I think I get the first turn with my Kodamia. I'll do my AoE and see what happens above up. Then he goes And then I can focus fire one unit and just keep on. Hmm. I think that that will work, but I'm a bit scared because I don't have defense break right now. But if I do not take something like a cases, my illusion will die for sure. So that's why I think I need thick cases. Let's try it. I think this is gonna be fine. Although the first match is a bit risky, but we'll see. We'll see. Okay, that Camellia is really fast. That means she has a bit less. Okay, let's buff up. Stun maybe? No other stun, but that's okay. Heal debuff. Let's just do an AoE to get some. So far, we're doing great. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Could have waited and killed Darien and then go for it, but that's okay. Stun maybe? Okay, I need to start heal. Okay, got the shield, so that's good. To be honest, I'll research right now and then do the heal right after. Okay, he dies. Heal up. Okay, this worked perfectly. Uh, let's just boost you up. Oh, I should have done amputation magic. That's my mistake. One more turn and I can put out the shield. Ooh, stun. Amputation magic. Nice. Good damage there. Put up the force shield again. I will start doing some heals. Don't know why I did. Oh, yeah, of course I did that for heal. I was wondering why I did that. But then I realized. Oh! It didn't go off. The. The dot, they actually took the dot, that's, I didn't knew she would get that. Okay, now it's going to be interesting. I think I can win, but it's never sure. Okay, extortion. Uh, Tyrone. Okay, good. I think we can kill him. There we go. That makes things a lot easier. So this is, match is pretty much GG as well. So I'm doing good, got two wins against two members that are relatively strong. Not the top man people, but they were already attacked a few times, so I'd rather go for people that are not attacked. To deal as much damage as I can to their guild. Gotcha. I don't need to. Go 
on that route yet. Because you're gonna die soon enough. Extortion, this is good because now I'm really low. Then I can take a big chunk out of his HP. Take that. He has about 36k, 35k, uh, 38. Blah, blah. Nice. GG. Victory. Look at that. Ooh, we're doing great. This is one of the top guilds. They're above us, and we're rank, what are we, 14? And they just lost the battle, I saw. That, before we attacked them, were, they were around here. So they dropped. They were rank 10. Uh, no, 11, sorry. So we're doing good. We got two members over here. I actually... Oh, that guy. I think he got attacked by Katora. Oh no, I thought he would get attacked by that. Hmm. This is a really heavy damage team. And this is the same team. Let's see what you got. Water, water. How am I gonna... Let me just think about this match. I wonder how I'm gonna kill this one. Oh wait! Actually, this setup could work perfectly against it. If you think about it, I mean, he has nothing to remove heals, so we could just do AoE. Obviously, Pra will be annoying with it, but still, with some stuns. The second match is also pretty nice. I could even get away with not using Iona there and just going for Baladon. Because um, he doesn't really have any particular unit that could kill my aim on uh, my Lemagos. Let me think about the first match again. Is it maybe smarter to not... Yeah, I think shielding up against him will save some of that. Oh, wait, oh, yeah, it's it's really bad against that to take. I could go with speed. That's not a bad idea. But there is a chance. Well, these two water units will attack you. Uh, there's a chance I'll need some more heal in that team. Maybe we can just take Iona there, why not? Because then I have the damage. I think I have the damage. In AoE form. And I could occasionally stun that unit. So these two will attack either Konamiya or Iona. Both will survive. Nobody will attack Lucian, which is good. Um, yeah, why not? I think this can uh, work. It's gonna be a long match, that's for sure, but I think we should do fine. Uh, you will daydream. Yeah, that second skill sucks. Nice, stun there. Uh, stun you then? I know. That didn't work. They got a high resistance. Let's do another AoE. Fallen Blossoms. Stun. Oh, that was... That would have been perfect, but that didn't help. That didn't happen. 9k, that unit is ruined for damage. Should be able to sustain it, but... Whoa, almost killed 2 there.
Fuck, I don't know what's smart. Okay. Holy shit! Get out of here! Don't get extra turns. Kill! Phew! At 35k is because he was lower than uh, a certain amount. But that's okay. We got him. That's why we have a unit there. Take that. Get an extra. Damn it! Nah, he's, she's not that high in health. I can just do an amputation magic over this. And maybe get a kill. Goodbye. Nice. This was good. He had a really uh, decent. Uh, what is it called? I uh, don't even remember the name. What is that dude called? Dragonite. What a Dragonite. Chow. That was, that was the name. He has a really good Chow. Uh, but the Chow wasn't enough to get my monsters killed. But still, was a really good monster. Oh god. He's gonna defense break the wrong unit. If I don't care. Oh god, this sucks. If he defense breaks this unit. Okay, get next turn. Nope. Oh, that's okay. I want to clean shot him now, but I don't have the turn yet. Oh, nice! I can clean shot. Pretty sure about that. Try to stun you. Goodbye. That was nice. Now I've won this one as well. Nice. Three wins against uh, three decent opponents. Not the best of that girl, but definitely some people that weren't attacked too much yet. Yeah? Yeah, I really need to be a bit more careful when I do my guild battles. Sometimes I just, especially when we're close to winning, I'm already like, oh, okay, we won, you know. And then I stop thinking for a second. I did sometimes, like, last two guild battles that I actually draw one is because I didn't think uh, far enough. Like I, I could have known that I we that I might have lost the second match because I didn't have the right setup to take down the other one but yeah that's something that everyone needs to remember when you fight sometimes obviously it's not bad to try things out when you know you win because then you can learn from it for the next battle but you gotta be careful because if you don't have a game plan it's gonna hurt your ass obviously you can win you can lose with a game plan but if you have a game plan and it doesn't work out uh, the way you intended it it could either be bad RNG or your game plan wasn't good enough but if you just go in without a game plan which I did like last kill battle uh, against the dark Chimera for example my game plan was really terrible then I should have just not fight that match because it's just not good obviously we already won the guild battle before I even attacked him but still it's my own loss for guild points so right now I actually thought of my setups there we go full damage on you as well take that so we if we win which we will we end up at rank 11 unless we get attacked obviously then we will get some damage there um, what was I wondering My first defense is really based on violent procs right now. That will change in the future because uh, violent will change. Okay, there. Let me see. There are a few members that are still full health. 
you what is your defense come on show it you have no defense okay there we go oh that was with the phoenix this one can be uh, one if you have a good uh, if you got Ifrit, the dark one, it's not that hard because Baladon and <coughs> Baladon and Darien will attack that and probably not kill it because they're not the heaviest damage unit ever. And you can just kill Vermos first or Baladon. I think Vermos killing him first is better with uh, whatever damage dealer you have. And then you can just keep take one like. Take Belladon of your own, like take Vermos, Belladon, and then another really good damage dealer to take care of uh, Vermos. That should win you the battle. And then the second, like the Phoenix, I mean, this is just a speed team. So if you can sustain this damage and get attack back, you will easily get them down. Like a fast Chloe would be awesome there. Okay. Oh, you even got attacked there. By who? Roxar. He demolished him. Oh, this is the guild that Chamira is in. Do you guys remember Chamira? He's one of the the mem the YouTubers. He's he's kind of gone from YouTube right now, but he's that guy. He got attacked by Dico and Quatra. Who's that? Why do we see that? They are getting attacked twice. Wow. They will be not. They won't be happy when they come back. Okay, that was it. Let me check the shop real quick. If we can find something amazing, apparently we cannot. Um, and then I'm going back to what I was doing, and you guys will see soon enough what I was doing. Uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next uh, video I make. What?